We are back again, dear viewers, with our second interview segment for today. Cancer is one of the most difficult experiences in a person's life, and it has changes in the physical effects as well as the psychological state, such as in anxiety, fear, sadness, disappear, and it is often a long and stressful experience for the patient his family and his friends as well. The extent and the severity of these factors may lead to oncology patients being exposed to psychological distress. And for sure, the truth is that our lives will never need help and the presence of the another person. More than we do at the time when life is already threatened. And for the paralyzing cancer patients, so the emotional involvement of the patient must be already sufficient and also the fast to prevent him from re retreating and also isolating himself. Our guest today, we're gonna it's already dedicate her time to relieving already the cancer patient and supporting them morally and also psychologically. We're already pleased to have with us today, uh, Madame Leila Jama. She's awareness ambassador. Hello and happy to be with us. Good morning. I am very happy. Good morning to you and thankful for you also because it, this one when we talking in uh, October pink October we call it it's good for me and good for the other ladies to listen for us exactly and it's always a pleasure to have you um, miss Leila actually and you always give me an optimistic uh, vibes actually thank you Sarah so first of all why is uh, the month of October important to be devoted to cancer awareness especially breast cancer I think all the world this is from uh, uh, all the world they celebrate in October, especially October for uh, the ladies who have the breast cancer. Yes. Yes. This one only in October for the breast cancer. How is actually it's important to, sh to, to spread actually the awareness about uh, this disease, such a disease? You have to advise them about the early detection. You tell them about how is their life is too much uh, value for them. And you have to learn how to talk to them and convince them to to go to this screening, you know? Yes, that's amazing actually. As well. And there is something else also. Uh, today is the day where today, t our our topics about, we call it the Pink October Day. Yes. You're already wearing the already the, the brooch pink. and also uh, the, the bracelets, everything dedicated about uh, the cancer awareness. And I love the, the scarf as well. The scarf <laughs> also. <laughs> and uh, today I also I like to greet our working crew, all of them, and also the preparer Hibbe for preparing this topic today about yes. the breast cancer awareness. So you already given a small advice for the people for to be aware. So you are a cancer fighter already. Yes, I'm cancer fighter. We, uh, on the off air, we talk about this thing. You already have a long journey with you, yes. but you become now a giver because of this kind of situation, yes. right? You know, uh, first of all, I want to thank you because when you mentioned this matter for the people, they will, um, you know, they will put in their mind mm. it's important for them to make the screening mm -hmm. in uh, October. Not in only October, but we uh, we tell them in October we put the focus on the breast cancer mm -hmm. because you know sometimes the woman uh, forget or didn't care about this screening. Maybe she's not aware also. Yes, sometimes they she didn't aware, mm -hmm. but the things when you see the awareness now, it's good for them. Mm -hmm. And I like if it's the TV, the radio talking about these things. It's uh, mean a lot for us. Also. It's reminding people. Yes, because we are all the time uh, missing our health, you know? Yeah. Yes. When we're coming to sometimes uh, a lot of pain, mm -hmm. we go to the doctor. Mm -hmm. You know, you know, it's, it goes me to another thing. Like sometimes, you know, our families is really encouraging us, go check up on yourself, yes, yes, do yes. blood tests, <laughs> do all the time, and we are very lazy sometimes we yes. go. Yes, that's why uh -huh. the health is very wealth to our yes. for ourselves. So uh, you are known, Miss Leila, about... Uh, be strong, be or strong. Yes, in be Arabic. Strong. So, and also you are a founder of Be Strong uh, Initiative. Tell yes. us more about uh, this initiative. It's important uh, its object as be well. Be strong. When I start to be uh, this one about the be strong, I want to tell the the woman mm -hmm. in all the world yes. that she is strong already. Mm -hmm. But be strong to go to the screening. Never afraid from the screening. You know, the, mm -hmm. the, a lot of women don't want to make the screening. Mm -hmm. The early detection is too much important for her. Be strong. And uh, 
to give them the support. You mentioned something nice, early detection. Yes. Is it important to yes. do always early detection? Yes. For the, we, so we say all the time prevention is better than cure, right? No, no. Yes, yes, that one right. But for the breast cancer, early detection it's better mm -hmm. because it's changed a lot of things. Mm -hmm. First of all, maybe you are in the first stage mm -hmm. and it's good for the lady in this stage. She can also, the treatment will be different. Mm -hmm. Yes. The early, yes, the early detection give her a chance to be uh, healthy more if she late. Mm -hmm. That is uh, why uh, important the early detection. Early, early detection. And because you are you suffered from uh, cancer, Ms. Yes. Leila, and you have a long history about that, your suffering, your challenges, and everything. So if someone or any girl in this world now is uh, suffering from breast yes. cancer, what do you what do your advice for her, actually? First of all, I tell her never lose your hope in God because mm -hmm. your God choosing you for these things because it's a gift of God to give you a new life. We are the reasons we can say. Yes, mm -hmm. you know, and sometimes uh, a lot of things we make it in our life, but we didn't see which is the important for us. The cancer give you a second time to choose the things for you good in, in good way. Uh, I all the time tell them never, never lose hope. Uh, never listen to anyone, only your doctors. This is the important things. And never be with uh, people not uh, positive. Yeah. Yes, that's yeah. why. You actually. always surround yourself with positive yes, people. This, this is, is important. The best. And there is something else. Before, before a long time ago, you've been in the studios as an individual, talk about your story. Then you have a community. Yes. Now your community became now engulfed in GCC. Yes. It keep increasing. Yes, your it's bigger. 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 Yes. Always it will come bigger. It will not be smaller again. So right. you have a GCC like members. So is it important like you as an awareness ambassador and you have a big group, big communities yes. to, to already initiative to make more communities for breast awareness cancer? Yes. I hope also the school, mm -hmm. also the school if about the awareness, mm -hmm. this one, it's be like a study for the mm -hmm. student. Mm -hmm. It's good for us. And we are now uh, especially in Kuwait have a big awareness uh, really a big awareness and not only being ribbon no mm -hmm. no you know when you talk to anyone now they have the knowledge to tell you about everything mm -hmm. so we have to teach our families our children mm -hmm. how to uh, encourage the people to make the early detection nice. yes and also let's talk now about the psychological point uh, of view. Uh, we know that if someone uh, uh, suffers from cancer, he or she feels um, yeah, anxiety, mm. stress, depression, and feels like her word or his word, it's end actually. Yes, I know. So what is the, m the importance of uh, psychological uh, point of view from their friends, their family, their, you know, uh, their relatives. What is uh, the importance of that? I think the first thing to be important for the patient, the family, the first. Okay. Must the family um, respect his wish? Maybe sometimes the patient don't want to talk mm -hmm. and don't want to tell about his suffering, you know? Yes. You have to respect these things. And sometimes the friend, you have to be surrounded with good the friend because this is uh, like a mission for mm -hmm. him. Uh -huh. How can see the good friend and the bad friend, you know? So I tell them all the time, choose the best. The best will be with you, the best who encourage you to, go to make the screening. Mm -hmm. This is the good. Mm, and uh, we can uh, see in the screen here is the Be Strong initiative here. Yes. You have a meeting see? here with the doctors? Yes. We make meeting like this uh, with the doctor, a specialist doctor, mm -hmm. and sometimes uh, all the one who coming, not only patients, sometimes the family. Oh. oh, friend, yes, not all patient. And sometimes I make uh, inside the, with the doctor, I make something treatment for them, uh, make them happy, uh, painting, drawing, something oh. else. Some and, hobbies, yeah. Jamal also, Harbi. Jamal Harbi, I saw too many public figures, doctors, yes. uh, EX uh, already, minister, too yes. many people and public figures no, and okay. celebrities. Yes, it's mm. good. You yeah. know, they go outside from my um, meeting like yeah. this, the gathering, because we call it, uh, Leila Jamal gathering. This just now, before two days, we make it. Oh, two days amazing. ago, huh? yes. yes, two days ago. What about the thumb sign? This one, be strong. Be strong. <laughs> yes. Be strong. <laughs> yes, that's amazing. So you feel uh, happy once uh, they they, yes. they actually feel uh, happy. You know, you know what make me happy? Sometimes mm -hmm. I see some patient falling down in there. I know lonely they don't want to talk to anyone yes but when they come to our group even her mother or her husband tell us thank you yeah. it's mean mm -hmm. a lot for me mm -hmm. if one of the patient mm -hmm. her family see the difference you know mm -hmm. we cannot see the difference 
but the one who closed to them see the difference and he told me uh, thank you so much nice. you make her life change maybe be, a lot of uh, patients don't want to take the chemotherapy a lot afraid from the yeah. hair pulling the body yes but we encourage her I tell sometimes I tell her look I'm stand up yes yes in front of you so this is the life God gave us to, they did uh, God didn't give us something wrong yes everything he gave it to us like a gift for us then that's change, amazing. You know? That's why change. I like um, her optimistic uh, soul and thinking, actually. Thank uh, you. And I know um, th the help of the cure is the psychological yes. point of view and the mm. supporting, actually, from the friends and family, as you mentioned. Mm. I, you mentioned something nice, family. Family, family is always the fi highest priority. Fi family always the first. For everyone, we have to share this. Even you have any circumstance, anything, yes. if you are busy, family always first. How does it feel like people always come to you, your daughters, your I family. I am very happy. Yeah. I told you She's I already took a picture for you yeah. Yeah, behind the she scene. She is uh, my journey friend. Okay. From the beginning until now, she all the time. She was me. strong from the beginning. Yes, and she's from the beginning. Yeah. From your beginning, you. from your sickness, actually. From yes. From the beginning of the cancer. From the first things, from wow. the operation. Mm. Until now, she is with me. Wow. Uh, she is my friend, not my daughter. You know, I feel happy when um, sometimes one of the husband for the, the patient, he told me, my wife don't want to make the operation. She afraid if she make the operation, she missing something from her body, and she feels she is not mm. beautiful. She will be guilty. Can you talk to her? When I talk to her, I tell her now everything available for you. Easy, sir. So. Right. Anything you wanna make it, you can make it. Then after two days, the husband tell me I am very proud of you, Leila, and I will tell my That's friend true. about you. These things mean a lot for me. And also, we are very proud of you. Thank you so much for being here. Thank, Thank you so you. much for sharing the awareness. Not only because the Pink October Month, because you are the one of the reasons that people you are a giver to already aware yes. the community. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Big appreciation and thanks to our guest Leila Jamal. She is awareness ambassador. Yes. And now, dear viewers we have a tiny break no today not tiny break because we already oh, we, we uh, reached the end, end actually time. the time's so run very fast actually <laughs> so dear viewers we reached the end of our episode today take you a good care of yourself and each other support your family always be your mind even you are busy in all the day have a phone call for your mom for your father for your family see you tomorrow more amazing episode have a good day everyone and i'm gonna say the phrase from our guest Leila jamal be strong and bye-bye Thank you.